was rocking this t-shirt for a really long time. Adorable girls. I mean, it says it all about me, really. They were actually the stylist's like own glasses that she was wearing like the whole day, and then last minute, she just popped them on me, and it completed the look. But sadly, I had to give them back. Hello, I'm Elle Devine, and I'm playing Throwback or Bring Back with Cosmo UK. In this game, I'll be looking back at outfits I've worn over the years and deciding whether I'd leave them in the past or bring them back. Let's go. So this one is from, I think this would have been like a few years ago now, like 2019 or something, and it was on like the hottest day ever. I was playing at the Seabright Arms in like off, just off Hackney Road, and it was the sweatiest gig I've ever done in my life. And I was super nervous, I hadn't done that many gigs at that point, so I got ready in a proper rush, and I'd worn the outfit inside out, so that shit is actually on like back to front. Um, and then I think, yeah, the designer messaged me afterwards and was like, you wore it back to front. But yeah, I, I would bring that outfit back. I wish I got to keep it. I would drop the I'm wearing like a, a fake Prada bag there though, that I got on holiday in like Spain or something so I would leave that out um, but yeah I'd definitely wear that shirt again it's cute. all right so this one was at the, the Swedish Grammys um, which was yeah really which was really fun I like this outfit like I just like, got it that day um, last minute trip to the Swedish Grammys um, but I like it yeah it's cool it's dead smart I would definitely wear this again have worn that again I think those pants as well those suit pants are like a good staple in my in my wardrobe, um, so definitely would bring that back. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like this look. Yeah, that denim jacket is like one of my favourite things in my wardrobe. I feel like if someone was gonna like describe me and what I was wearing, it would be that jacket with bare headphones on. So I definitely bring that back, and I like those cycling shorts as well. They were a fun staple for the summer. Um, so yeah, I'd bring that look back. Cute. This was in I think this was in New York. This is quite a few years ago. I don't know, I mean, it's all right. I don't know if I would, I'm would. i in a rush to bring that one back. I like, the, the one thing I do like about that, you can't really see it on there, but I've got a pin badge that I found in New York, and it's from um, this show called Pretty Wild, and it's like this scene, this girl called Alexis Nyers, and she does this interview, and it's like the fun, you need to just Google that, Alexis Nyers Vanity Fair interview, and it's like the most iconic thing ever, and it's like a pin badge of her having a meltdown. But yeah, maybe not the rest of it. I'd probably, I'm not in a rush to bring that one back, but the pin badge, I'd keep hold of that. <laughs> I like this one, this one's cool. That was from the Sh More Life shoot, a song that I was featured on. What were the pants? Like Alexander Wang or something? It was a cool look. I like that look. I would definitely bring that back. I love that look. That coat is hard. Um, yeah. Oh, I would oh, so bring this one back. I've actually lost that t-shirt. I don't know where it is, and I really want it in my race ahead t-shirt. I think that's really cool. And yeah, I, I was rocking that neon bag for a while. Um, but it's really see-through, so it got like absolutely filthy. So maybe I would, I'd leave that out just because it, it looks rank now. <laughs> it was just a bit hard to maintain. I had to give it a wipe like every now and then. It was gross, just like, yeah. Aww. I love this, I love this jacket. I actually, funny that you picked this photo because I actually said to my mum like not long ago, I wish I still had this jacket because I would like rock it now. I stole it from my, my childhood best friend, Niall. Um, so it was actually his, but it looked better on me. So then I just rocked it. Um, yeah, and the lollipop, I bring that back as well. <laughs> I love this look. Um, this was a shoot for a song I did with Route 94 called Sad Songs. I think this was the press shoot. Um, and I loved those pants. I loved the look. I love I love green with my orange hair because it makes me feel like poison ivy. So yeah, I definitely bring those pants back. I wish I got to keep those pants. They're amazing. I would, yeah, I love I love this one. I feel like this is like a an icon, not an iconic look, it's just a t-shirt. But I don't know, I, I, I was rocking this t-shirt for a really long time, which adore girls. I mean, it says it all about me, really. They were actually the stylist's like, own glasses that she was wearing like the whole day, and then last minute, she just popped them on me and it completed the look, but sadly had to give them back. <laughs> um, so I would definitely bring that back. Ah, so this was this was actually one of the first shows I'd ever done as Elle Divine. There's this artist called Rat Boy, and I did, um, like a writing session with him and like wrote a, like a hook for one of his songs um, and then randomly like a few months later he invited me to just like come up on stage for that song and sing it with him. I think that was in like 2017 and I'd not done any live shows yet um, as Elle Divine, so I was like super scared. It was in at Brixton like in front of loads of people. But it was dead fun. It was really really good. 
I mean, I would, I'm not in a rush to bring that one back. I think I'd leave that look. Just plain black look, isn't it? I think I could do better than that. <laughs> this one, I, I, I still wear this all the time, but everyone always rips me for this because they always say I look like like Steve Irwin or something. I look like I'm about to take someone on safari. I don't know if I'm allowed to say this, but it like gives me a massive comfort. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know if I'm... <laughs> Like that's what everyone used to pick up about. So I don't know, I kind of stopped wearing, stopped wearing that one. It doesn't have much room for me. <laughs> yeah, that's <was> cool. <laughs> I'm not really feeling it. I think I'd leave this one. Um, <laughs> okay, this. Yeah, I would, I would bring this one back. I like, I like a, like a long leather blazer. It gives me like Buffy the Vampire Slayer vibes, which I definitely like that. Sarah Michelle Gellar is like my all time number one crush as Buffy. Um, so yeah, I would bring that back. Rock my Buffy vibes. Cute, all right. Um, I don't know if I would bring this specific look back, but maybe like an alternative version of this. I love just like anything that's like a bit tomboyish is probably like when I feel most myself when I'm kind of just like dressed in my slouchy tomboy clothes. So maybe not that look, but I would definitely all day have a t-shirt on, definitely. <laughs> Thank you for watching, bye. <laughs>